Hey guys, it's Veronica Franks here, and I am going to quickly explain a little bit about the LuLaRoe inventory uh, spreadsheet for end of year uh, inventory count. All right, to start, you open up your document, and then you're going to enter your inventory count into these yellow cells. Uh, once you have those yellow cells finished, um, you will see over here the total. These are the total number of pieces of each of these styles. Down here we have the total of all in this category. Over here for wholesale value, uh, it is calculated the uh, value for all of your Amelia's at wholesale. And then at the bottom here, you see the wholesale value of all of your dress category. Now moving on, if you scroll all the way to the bottom, you'll see this little area which gives you the total number of pieces on your spreadsheet. So your total number of inventory that you have will be this number, the wholesale value of your entire inventory, and then also the, uh, the wholesale minus 5%, which LuLaRoe gives you a 5% discount when you purchase wholesale. Okay, next up is how to copy and paste cells from one tab to another. Um, I did not connect the cells from wholesale to retail, so they don't automatically transfer to, from one to the other. So a simple way to do this is to select the yellow cells. Remember to just select the yellow cells. Let me try this again. I press Control C, and then I'm going to move over to the retail tab. And in the top left corner, I'm going to press Control V, and all of my numbers now are in the retail tab. If you scroll down to the bottom of the retail tab, you will see here in this little section the total number of pieces, which should match your wholesale tab, and also the retail value of your entire inventory. If this spreadsheet is something that you think you might be able to use, feel free to go to veronicafranks.com and right here on the main page, there's a link right here. You click on that to download the spreadsheet. It'll pop up in your downloads area. Once you click on that, you wait a few seconds and it should pop up. Let's hope so. Okay, so once it pops up, you may have to click enable editing. And at that point, you can then get started on entering your inventory count. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.